Mixed race couples have long been tabooed, but scientific evidence shows there is more than meets the eye with mixed race beauties like Holly Berry. In fact, genetic diversity is favored for health and beauty, and the reasons behind this are relevant. The Amish, hardworking, pious, devoted to their secluded way of life, and certainly consisting of some physically attractive people, face some interesting consequences from lack of genetic diversity. Although the Amish make sure to marry outside family, their small closed population makes less genetic genetic diversity inevitable, leading to conditions such as dwarfism or polydactyly having more than 10 fingers. So why does this happen and what are the broader implications? Since encoded genes in DNA determine the physical qualities shown in people, the answer comes down to what happens within genes when there is little genetic diversity. Normal gene components, often referred to as wild type, are typically dominant, meaning they will mask and cancel out their complementary components, those inherited from the other parent. If if the other components are recessive. This does not always occur so simply as there are such things as varying dominance, but a general rule is that a mutation, any part of a gene which is changed from the wild type, is recessive. Mutations occur all the time, from errors in DNA processing to radiation damage, and they are mostly bad, though some may be good for surviving in new environments. Because such recessive mutations only physically show up when the other complementary gene component is also recessive and not the normal, dominant type, the rare cases where recessive mutations show up is when both parents are carriers of the particular mutation. Here's where little genetic diversity is not so great, as those who are more closely related have a higher likelihood likelihood of containing the same recessive mutation in a particular gene inherited from the same common ancestor. This allows the mutation to be expressed physically, and in the case of the Amish, it means conditions like polydactyly. Such benefits of genetic diversity and so-called hybrid vigor have also been documented in dogs and crops, where mixed breed dogs have less health complications and crops receive the best traits from genetically different parents. Even mice, when cloned using an embryonic stem cell method, will have a high death rate shortly after birth unless other genes are introduced, and the low genetic diversity of cheetahs has made their breeding and survivorship strained. In comparison, humans have these concerns hardwired into the the recognition of facial attractiveness. Research has shown a more average facial symmetry and shape is favored, indicating such qualities as an effective immune system and less risk for deleterious mutations. This being said, other research indicates there is also significant influence from the cultural and societal definition of beauty, so to some extent, the expression beauty is in the eyes of the beholder still can be valid.